Okay, making a cardboard prop tractor. I'm going to start with this piece here. This is the hub that goes inside my wheel. So I'm going to fold along all the squared lines, just like this, until I get this form. Like this side there. Make sure it's aligned and just hold it in place until it's dry. Fold on the squared lines like this and just slot that inside, like so. Same on the other side. Okay. That's my hub. I'm going to take my cardboard wheel and I'm going to slot that inside. Just to make sure that the hub and the wheel are glued together. Okay. So you do that four times. I'm going to make my body. And make that into a rectangular box. Okay. And then the flap with the angles on it goes on the inside. Hold that in place and I'm going to run a little bit of glue along it. Like this. And then hold that in place. And I'm going to close the ends of the box. I'm pushing these two little flaps. And again, the side with the angles goes in. And pop a little bit of glue on there. I'm going to shape the other end. So I'm going to push my two little flaps in. Same thing again. The piece with the angles is going to go in first. And put a little bit of glue inside here. And then just hold that firmly in place. And make sure my box is nice and square. I'm going to take one of my cubes, my cube shape. And again, where it's scored, I'm going to fold along those lines all the way around. Just like this. until I have my box shape. So same thing again, the flaps go on the inside. Put a little bit of glue on the flap. Pull the box in line. Just make sure it's all squared up. And again, just hold that until it's dry. And on the other side, Put a little bit of glue on the flaps again. And last step, I'm going to close the top of the box. Just make sure all my flaps are in. And run glue around the three sides. And close up that box. Next piece I'm going to make is this. The same thing again. Anywhere the squared lines, I'm going to fold a piece of card. I'm going to fold this over into this shape here. I'm going to start at the side. Holding it over and just making sure it's square. And tuck these two flaps in. Fold that in place like that. And then a little bit of glue inside. And then close the top. Then in place, put a tiny little bit of glue in there. Okay, I'm going to start assembling the vehicle. I'm take my four wheels, 
got two dowels, two long dowels, which are going to act as axles. And then I got one short dowel. So to prepare this first, I'm going to take one of the washers and just push the dowel through a little bit so it's just slightly protruding. With a little bit of glue on top to make a T. Like this. Next step is I'm going to take this triangular piece. And it's got a hole in these sides here. I'm going to slide my axle through the holes. And then I'm going to sandwich it with two washers. Okay. I'm going to put a wheel on either side. Do the same thing again. I'm going to put a washer on either side to hold the wheels in place. Make sure that my wheels are moving freely. Put a little bit of glue on the outside of the washer to hold it in place. And on the other side. So I'm just spinning the dowel to get the glue all the way around. I'm going to set that aside to dry. I'm going to take my other long axle. And you have a cube with a hole in it to the side like this. And do the same thing again. The axle through, sandwich with two washers, center, make sure it moves okay. Put my two wheels on, and then add two washers to the axle. Okay. Check my wheels again. Okay, so I'm going to go back to this first piece that I put together. I'm going to take the washer that I put on the dowel shaped like a T and push that under this triangular piece. Add a washer. And I'm going to take my rectangular body, slide that on top, and finally put another washer on. Okay, so it's moving freely with not too much space between. I'm going to add the back. So you'll see on this there's a high side and a low side. You want to make sure that when you add your rectangular body to this cube that it comes over the tops of your wheels. Blue on the top of that. Make sure it's nice and square. And I'm going to take my other cube piece. Okay. And again, when you set it in place, make sure it's nice and square and that the top comes over the wheels. So I have the wing and a little bit of glue on top of this cube. And then I'm going to center my wing on that. The next step, I'm going to take my motor, take the shaft to my motor. I'm going to put my two propellers in place with those. And these are going to sit approximately an inch in from the edge of my wing. I'm going to put my propeller on and just make sure it sits a little bit over the edge and that the propeller can move freely. My vehicle is constructed. I'm going to start my electronics. <laughs>